Hi, it's Kick Up Kristen. Welcome back to my channel. Today I was inspired by prom season, so I created this beautiful purple glitter cut crease look. So if you want to see how to get it, then just keep watching. <laughs> I'm using my 35B Morphe brushes palette and dipping into this purpley pinky shade with this blending brush that I got from the Wish app and going right into my crease up to my brow bone. I'm slowly building up that color until I get the intensity that I want. Next, I'm going into the Masquerade palette by Juvia's Place and dipping into this plum shade with this flatter blending brush and putting that right into my crease below the first shade. Going back to my 35B palette, I'm dipping into this royal purple color and going right into my crease below that second shade with that same brush. To add more depth, I'm going into the Magic palette by Juvia's Place and dipping into this color right here. And I'm using this small tapered brush and going right below that third shade and blending it upwards. I found that this color was a little bit hard to blend out and wasn't as dark as I wanted it to, so I just sprayed my brush with some setting spray and that seemed to help a little bit. Make sure you're really taking your time during each step to blend out those colors because you want this to be very gradient and seamless. After blending everything out, I'm taking my MAC Studio Finish Concealer in the number NC35 with this little flat brush and cutting my crease. If you have a hooded lid like me, it's important that you bring that purple shade way above your double lid. That way it'll show when you cut your crease. Once you've cut your crease and evenly applied the concealer on your lids, blend out the edges with your finger into the eyeshadow. Going back into my 35B palette and picking up this shimmery off-white with this flat brush and applying it to the first inner third of my lids. With that same brush, I'm dipping into this yellow and applying that to the center of my lids. For more color payoff, make sure you are tapping on those colors. Next, I'm dipping into this periwinkle color with this flat brush and lining my top lash line. I'm picking up this shimmery royal blue from my Jaclyn and Morphe brushes palette and applying that to my outer V with my little tapered brush. To create a more gradient effect between the blue and the yellow, I'm picking up this mustard yellow with that same little tapered brush and just blending away. Right here, I just picked up some more yellow from that 35B palette and applied it a little bit closer to my inner corners. I didn't show you what I did for my bottom lash line, but I pretty much used the same colors. To create the glitter cut crease, I'm using this glitter from Lemonhead LA and using an eyeliner brush to apply it right on top of that cut crease line. You can actually apply it a little bit below the line so you can see that purple shining through. I also applied a little bit of that glitter to the first third of my bottom lash line. I just created a mini video on Instagram showing you these lashes, so go and check that out on my story. Well, this is the final look with the lashes. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you like this look. It came out exactly how I pictured it, so I'm really happy with the outcome. Thumbs up if you liked it, if you thought it was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have fun at prom. Stay caked, stay fierce, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!